should the ore be screened? Gold bearing ore contains material with a wide particle size range. These include fine silt or clay particles, sands and larger particles like gravel, several centimeters in size. The gold in contrast found at most mining operations in Guyana has a much more restricted range from a maximum of perhaps 2 cm to 3 cm down to less than a tenth of a millimeter. Separation of gold works best when all of the particles are of similar size as coarse grain, less dense particles, coarse sand and pebbles can behave in a similar way to fine grain, dense particles, in this case gold. Screening can be as simple as removing large particles such as boulders and cobbles. Why should the ore be screened? Screening removes coarse grained materials that does not contain recoverable gold. It reduces the volume of material to be treated by the sluice box and increases the proportion of gold in the sluice box feed. It eliminates clay balls that would otherwise pick up gold particles and take them to the tailings. It improves the overall performance of the sluice box process. Screening increases the likelihood that gold will be recovered from the ore because the movement of the gold particles in the sluice box will be determined by its high density and shape that will lead to its recovery rather than its particle size. The simplest way to screen gold-bearing ore is to use a screen whose apertures or openings can be a series of circular holes or slots as seen here on this grizzly screen. The coarser material remains on the screen while finer material passes through to the matting below. These screens can either be fixed or static as in the case of the trapped grizzly screen or rotary as in the case of the trammel screen. Choosing the screening size is a trade-off between the efficiency of the subsequent processing and the amount of ore that can be processed, that is, the volume throughput, as well as the ore at each mining site. A screen with a small hole size will produce fine-grained feed material for the sluice box, which will then be able to operate efficiently and at high gold recoveries. One should note that the smaller the hole, the larger will be the demand on screen area. That is, smaller hole means larger screening. However, it is possible that oversized material from screening can contain gold. So it is recommended that the oversized material be crushed to recover the unlocked gold. This has been a product of the Mineral Processing Unit of the Mines Division, Guyana Geology and Mines Commission, Upper Breakdown, Georgetown. For more information, you can call us on 592-225-6691 or 592-225-2862, extension 292 or 329, or visit us at our head office.